Yes, yes, your boy's back at it. A couple things I picked up. A couple picks for the ACBA page. Let's jump into it. Check it. Got that new Pac-Man joint. Had to go to uh, Toys R Us. Had to pick some up for the nephew. So this Pac-Man joint picked it up. It was made by, by by Bandai. Made by Bandai. Crack it open, see what it is. Here's another quick one for the page. It's an uh, Ninja Gaiden fig. That showed up last time. That Ryu Hayabusa. This is my setup. <laughs> I haven't took that bad boy off there yet. I love this background piece. It's dope. This right here is from uh, McFarlane. I think it's online exclusive spawn. I put that there so it could look like it was kind of an unbuilding. I think I had a little bit more. Whatever. I had somewhat like that. It's the Batman base. Two lights. <coughs> Took a couple picks. And, uh, you know, the B side, the C side. Show you what it was. That's what it is right there. It's in the Pac Man joint. It's alright. I smooth up and down. Twist is here. The feet twist. Um, you open it up. It's got that tongue. I don't know what all that's about though. Probably something new. Um, the only thing I wish it just that the legs moved. They bend a little bit. I wish they moved a little bit more. Maybe I'll take a couple shots with it. I know I gotta mess with it a little bit. See what I can come up with. I don't know. I don't, I don't dig this whole tongue thing here. I don't, I, I don't feel that. Spend the pack. So you got a little piece put on put on my shelf. This is a quick shot for the page. A little Ghostbuster action right here. I gotta set up. Backpack is lit up like that. All right, went up to Toy Con today. Hung out with Tony B and Ed for a minute because that's a bounce. I couldn't stay there that long. Just picking up some stuff from Ed. Uh, did a quick run around and uh, picked up this Duro and Murrow Walking Dead uh, two pack. SDCC. Uh, albino man bat still works. Good condition. The box is really good condition. There's a, there's a Here's the box. on the other side. I was watching uh, Lunker Mouth about the odd video and uh, he had this uh, Freddy Krueger. So uh, I was I don't, I don't know why but I was like really thinking about getting it and I did see and I passed it up. And then when I was watching Bob's video, it just uh, it just made me get it. 
and he took some some really nice pics with it. So I was like, fuck it. Got a 15 bucks. Jump on it. Alright, this is the stuff I went to pick up from uh, my boy Ed. The Wolverine line. We got Cyclops, Sabretooth, and that Wolverine. Pretty nice. Actually, got to pick out. Well, except for this one, we only had one. He had two of each of these. And uh, the paint on them, man. I, I don't know, man. Really sloppy. I know I'm a frost, but he says he's going to hook me up with the piece to his body. So, uh, at least I have Puck. And my boy Ed, he also brought these. Oh, this one. Uh, he's holding another one for me. I still got to get Dr. Manhattan. I tell Watchmen. He's a comedian. He's a little box. There he is right there. Put this face sculpt on there. I like this grimacing, cheesy, 80s cop mustache with a scar on his face. Here's another pick for the page. Uh, messing around with the, the comedian. That's dope. The only thing I don't like about it is knees. Don't really kind of bend far back. I ain't feeling that. It's pretty dope though. It's a wrestling figure. I don't know where that's from. There's the setup. Those are the WWE backstage. I got two of them, so that's one, two, one, two. Set up again. I use this face expression like he's hurt. Comedians just uh, laughing. Bang, bang. <laughs> it's equipment for the page. I'm just uh, fucking around. Getting it in. <laughs> well, he's getting it in anyway. So. Ghostbuster shit. Give a shout out. Bang bang! I had to give a huge shout out to my boy Cheech. He hooked this up for me. He hooked up that set for uh, like ninety bucks, and um, I sold the game to one of my boys for forty. So I got the set for 50. I'm not really a gamer. Not that I have time now. But a uh, really dope set. This is the collector's edition for the Batman Arkham Origins. Sick as hell. You got all the TVs that light up. Really nice. That's what it is right there. Got the Joker right here. Got stacks of money. Briefcase full of money. You got a gun. Got a couple of these things here. You got a teddy bear right there with the with the head off. Fucking nice as hell. It's got a rug. Nice table. Let's see your little size comparison. This is a Watchmen DC Direct. So those are a little on the bigger side, maybe like seven inches. I don't think I got a six inch figure right here. Yeah, but it works. Um, let me see. And the 
back of it's nice too. Got the little antennas. Got what? I ain't got 11, 12, like 14 TVs right here. The batteries. This little switch. Turn it off. Very, very nice. Very nicely detailed. Nice washes. Pretty dope. Uh, I want to take all this shit off. So I heated mine up. He's like on these pegs right here. I just heated it up, popped it off. Took all this off. I think it's gonna leave you with that. I didn't try it. I just heated it up and just popped off like that. I'm not gonna mess with it anymore. So I took that off. That's nice. I took all of this off. It's gonna be good holes. Uh, which you probably fill it in and paint it. Maybe chop those off and make them flat. I won't be doing that. I figure something out. So I do shit like that. You know, I can make it look. This one I didn't take it off. I heated it up and I tried to put like a knife through there. I didn't want to press my luck, so I just left it on there. I took the bread off. Took that off took the gun off actually this one kind of broke a little bit but that's fine took this off I took all the pieces off I just heated it up with a blow dryer there it is you know, some of you guys that mess with uh, pain and all that other stuff you'll be able to Fill it in and paint it real nice. That you might have to shave it down. So TVs. Really dope. Doesn't sit flush. It's got like these pegs on the bottom. So it's really not gonna sit flush to the ground space there really nice detail on the rug that oriental definitely take some shots with this shit's dope um let me see if i get figure is out and then the saber tooth you know it's one of the bigger figures so it works perfectly Here, squeeze it in there pretty good. I didn't try taking that table off though. my luck and fucking break it but um this is all I got till next one